Welcome to this new video lesson proposed by BiologyExplained.com. If you wish to know more, please visit the site. You can, also, use the forum to propose your questions. In this lesson we will cover the basics of glucose transport, including information about GLUT and SGLUT transporters. Glucose is a sugar formed by six atoms of carbon. It is an aldohexose, meaning that he has a aldose, CHO, functionality. The brute formula of glucose is C6H12O6. The molecule of glucose is not able to direct pass through membrane, so he needs a transporter. The molecule of glucose is, mainly, absorbed in the intestine. Glucose is present in many foods and we assume it through the diet. However glucose derives from more complex molecules such as saccharides, polysaccharides and starch. In this example we can see a common disaccharide, the saccharose. It is formed by two molecules, glucose and fructose. If the linking bound is broken, glucose and fructose are, now, single sugars. The transport of the glucose is a secondary, active, process. When glucose reaches the lumen, it is moved inside the cell by SGLT, a sodium glucose transporter. The energy is taken from chemical gradient, created by the slash K pump. In order to maintain low concentration of sodium, less than 5 mol, the K pump is working at the basolateral side of the cell. Potassium is able to reach again the interstitial liquid by using a channel. Using this mechanism sodium is always present in low concentration inside the cell while potassium is present at high concentration. The pump also serves as a vehicle for this glut transporter because it creates the electrochemical gradient. As shown in picture, a class of passive transporter called glut is used to move glucose from cell to interstitial liquid. A lot of gluts isoforms exists and they are, also, located at the opical part of the membrane. Thanks for watching. If you want to know more, please visit the website, biologyexplained.com. You can read thousands of pages regarding biology, chemistry, pharmacy, and so on. Post your question inside the forum biologyexplained.com slash forum slash